All right, so today's video is another one of my stupid ideas. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I know I keep coming up with them. I think this is the stupidest idea I've had yet. Yep. <laughs> So there was this weird big trend that happened like a year ago where people started getting inside giant balloons. I don't know how the hell this thing started, but I bought a balloon at this time. I thought, I want a piece of this. I want to get in a huge balloon. That looks awesome. So I bought one. No, I actually, I bought two and then they came in the post and they just sat there and I've never used them. So today we're going to use them. Hello? So here it is, giant balloon. Look at this, this thing is heavy AF, it's so thick as well. Is it just me or does it look like a giant whoopee cushion? Oh, it's starting to rain. No, please no more rain. Please no more rain. After that last video where we made the huge cardboard fort thing. Oh my. <laughs> If you didn't watch that video already, go and watch it, but don't leave just yet. There's going to be a link to that right at the end of this video. We made a cardboard fort and it got wet. It was windy. It was a storm. Why is it raining now? It's literally not rained all morning. And I've just come out with camera for two minutes and it's raining. All right, so weirdly enough, I'm going to be getting in this thing. It's, I know, I'm good. Me, me is going to be in this thing for a whole night. This is going to be awesome. Obviously, I'm going to be spending the whole night in this thing. So I'm going to need food. I'm going to need drink. I'm just going to need general supplies and fun things to do while I'm in there just to help me get through the night. You know what I mean? So we will be going to the shop soon, getting those supplies. I'm going to be getting some surprises as well, no doubt. But I'm not going to tell you what they are until later when it happens. But anyway... Go follow me on Instagram. I posted a cheeky little picture of this on Instagram before the video went online. So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably knew this was going to happen before it happened, like a little teaser. If you didn't know, you obviously don't follow me on Instagram. Link in the description below. My username's at KillimFTW. Go follow me and follow him back. Also, I do stupid stuff like this every three to four days. So make sure you smash that subscribe button down below if you haven't already. And if you are already subscribed, press that little bell icon right next to the subscribe button and you'll be notified every time I upload. What's that thing? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going to take me so long to edit. Why am I doing this? Why? I'll just press that little button. It's as easy as that. I'm going to try and get in this. Let's have a go. Wait, moon, moon, moon. Get the leaf blower. <laughs> hey. I'm in! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's it. All that just for that, yeah? Yeah. So, uh. Yeah, that's it. Oi, Thomas. What? Are we done filming? Yeah, we're done. <laughs> what did you do that for? <laughs> I mean, we've done the intro. Are we not done filming? No, we've got to do other stuff to do later. Alright, so I'm in the shop, supply hunting. I've wandered off somewhere. I don't usually come to this shop. I don't know where I am. <laughs> Hello? Go, go, go. <laughs> right, so we're in a different shop. We don't usually come to this one, so we're like, I don't know where stuff is. But anyway, today's mission is that the supplies we're going to get have got to be round. So like, is it got to be like a ball shape or has it got to be round but can be flat? Yeah, round. I... Like a ball? And it's just got to be round? Yeah, there's, there's loads of fruit and veg there, round, so it's going to be quite easy. Phil, no fruit and veg. Come on, let's go find some real food. What am I doing with the... I forgot to mention the reason we're doing round food is because we're in a balloon, which is round, so it makes sense to me, I think. It's the roundest food I've ever seen. I don't know, I, I've got no clue what it is. <laughs> they look like little balloons. Yeah. <laughs> Let's have them. What food is more known? What food is better known? I don't even know what I'm trying to say. What food is more known than than being at donuts around? <laughs> <laughs> On cookies and cookies as well. I really like this round food theme. Ferrero Rocher's. Oh, they're gorgeous. Getting some really good food. We need to get some proper food, you know. Pro like, healthy. Yeah, that's good. You just have sweets and chocolate stuff. Yeah. Come on then, fruit again. 
I don't usually get fruit. I mean, like, what's this? Persimmon. I've never heard of a persimmon. It's got instructions. Maybe, maybe you like it. <laughs> Eat it whole like an apple. It says it on it. <laughs> on your rings, do they count? Ooh. Yeah, they do, but they smell bad. Obviously, we're going to be in a balloon. It's a tight space in there, so we can't get too much food. So maybe like one, maybe two more things maximum. Need some drinks. Mm -hmm. Is that it? Mm -hmm. Is that everything? Is, is there something else? Or? Mm -mm. You got your hoodie wrong way on. Have I? Yeah. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> I really want some cheese. Baby Bell. Baby Bell's round. What's this one? I think it's different, different flavours. What? thing drinks I mean I don't know what the hell this is it says monster I, I like monster it's round if you do this it's orange flavor yeah. oranges around I'll get a few of these I've got a few of a surprise I've not shown you so I'm gonna show you them later keep them surprised it's gonna be good it's gonna be a lot of fun let's go get in a balloon for the night 12 hours <laughs> we've got the blanket here on the floor because when we blow the balloon up we don't want the like balloon to pop on any sharp things here on the floor that we can't see moon scale balloons aren't you i'm scared to death i get as far away from them as i can well you've got to help me blow this thing up yeah i know it scares <laughs> me already and finally i've had to get changed i've got some tight clothes on because obviously when i'm trying to squeeze into this thing it's going to be real hard if i've got baggy clothes in the way so i mean these are like the tightest clothes i've got let's do one of them real nice things with the music and make everything look cool and easy and easy go <laughs> Down. Oh, oh, that's awesome. You know what I mean? Oh, that's a really good idea. Here we go, we're in. <laughs> this is insane. I'm inside a balloon right now. No way. <laughs> I'm actually recording this on the phone because we've got the camera in. I don't know what's happened to it. It instantly like steamed up. It stopped working. It doesn't like being in here. So that's why it probably looks a little bit different to normal. But we're still in here. We're good to go right now. I've got all my stuff. Got my food. Got my drink. I've got some other cheeky surprises as well. Not going to show you them just yet. They'll come later. I've got everything like on my legs. I don't want anything touching the actual balloon. I don't want to risk popping this thing. Seriously, the only thing touching the balloon right now is me. Everything I've got here is on me don't want anything accidentally like pricking it and it's all exploding at once i feel like this thing could just explode any second and it's like it's just intense the whole time it's just intense <laughs> this is crazy this is crazy let me just do a quick room tour why not this this is it i guess we've got a good old g fuel bottle to plug it in there's like the walls and stuff and me uh, just look at that uh, we're gonna do a real quick camera swap. We're gonna go to Moon Vision so she can show you what it looks like from the outside. Go. That looks insane. <laughs> I've never seen a balloon that big. Hey. Oh Hello. god, that that's, that looks kind of scary. Obviously, we're inside a balloon. This is just dangerous AF. Seriously, could suffocate easily. So, kids, do not do this at home. Do not do this at school. Do not do this at work. If you work, I don't know why. If you work, just <laughs> don't do it anyway. <laughs> don't just don't do it. <laughs> So when I did the Zorbo video, we had to refresh the air every two hours because there's only a limited supply of oxygen in there. When you breathe, it uses it up. So obviously we're gonna have to do that in here as well. There's like, I don't even think there's one hour's worth of air in this thing because this is a lot smaller than the Zorb. So every hour we're gonna refresh the air in here. We're gonna be in here 12 hours. So we're gonna have to refresh the air 12 times throughout the night. Oh, one more thing. There's like an extra safety precaution. Moon's not gonna be here with me the whole night. It's literally, it's just gonna be me and you, except when Moon comes and refreshes the air, she's gonna be in the house. She's got a baby monitor. So if anything goes wrong, she can hear what I'm shouting, she can see what's going wrong, and then she can get here real fast if I need her. 
at this monster drink thing, whatever it is, let's try it. I'm, I'm so sweaty right now. It's so hot in here. Really need a drink. That's not bad. Tropical thunder. Not much tea. Oh, I really want to lay down, my back is killing me, but these, I don't want to touch these sweaty walls. I don't trust laying down, I don't want to pop this balloon. If it pops, it's challenge over. Also, Moon has just gone. It's literally, it's just me and you right now. So, uh, what shall we do? <laughs> um, hello? Anyone there? Pop it. Twist it. Cradle it and comb it and selfie it. What? This is too millennium for me. I'm a 90s kid. I just want twist it, bop it, pull it. That's it. I'm simple. I don't want selfie it, hammer it, golf it, comb it, cradle it, bop smash it. it. Shut up! I'm going to sleep. Yeah, me too. That's a good idea. Moon! Moon, I need ya! We come here, please, Moon! I could breathe again. I could hear you very well, so it's good. It uh, works very well. That's good. Are you alright? Yeah. Need anything? No, I'm all good, thank you. Okay. See you in another See hour. Bye. So a surprise that I bought for us while we're in here. You know, we've got 12 hours, so we've got to have some fun. I bought this little robot. It's called Mip. It says Mip on him. But you know, like, society can't tell us what to do. He's not blocking our creativity. We'll call him whatever we want to call him. I'm going to call him Pim. <laughs> So obviously I mean, there's not a lot of room in here to play with Pim. Literally there's no flat surfaces here. I thought the balloon might have been bigger when we were in here. So I thought we might have had more room to play with him. But I'll, I'll give him a go. Oh. oh no. Oh this is just disgusting. Pim! Pim! It's freaking out! Pim's freaking out! He's attacking! Oh Pim. Oh Pim. <laughs> Oh, what goodies we got in my bag? I've not opened it yet. What are these things? Oh, that's a broken one. Let's try this puffy ball thing. I don't know what it is. It just smells like nothing. That literally tastes like nothing. Why does it exist? It tastes like nothing. It smells like nothing. So I'm going to try this fruit thing. I don't know what it is. I can't remember if it began with a P or an S. Anyway, apparently you eat it like an apple. I cut that. That tastes so nice. I have to start eating fruit more. <laughs> don't tell Moon. <laughs> I'm not even really that hungry to be honest. It's like it's so hot in here and sweating. I'm just losing so much liquid. I really need to drink more than I'm eating. I mean, I've only got three of these bottles to last me 12 hours. <sighs> Are you okay? Yeah. Good. We're done. Done. I made this two weeks ago. Now I think it's time to use it. Oh! Homemade stink bomb. I'm gonna turn the radiator on in the garage so he heats up in there and he has to stretch his head out and then the whole garage is gonna smell of that disgusting stuff. And while this is happening, I'm gonna watch him on the baby monitor. This is gonna be fun. I just had to turn the camera on, I man. Why is it getting so hot in here? It's just all of a sudden, it's just. Oh, it's really, I don't know what, <laughs> what it is. Yo, no joke, seriously, it feels like a sauna in here. I don't know how long until the next air refill. I'm gonna have to stick my head out here or something. This is just insane. <sighs> oh. Oh.
need to save her. Stop! Stop! <laughs> Hello. My that stinks! Why is it so hot? What's that smell? I can't smell anything. <laughs> You're still, what is it? Oh god, it's <coughs> Open garage door! Oh. Open the garage door! Oh. Wait. Oh. Uh. 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 What is it? I made a stink bomb a couple days ago. You made a stink bomb? Uh. Where is it? Down here. Uh. Yeah. I just can't get comfortable. It's just. Oh, I really want to lay down so much, my back's killing, my legs are cramped. Look at this, my legs are wet through. Oh, it's disgusting, all this stuff is here, it's got it's leaving like white powder on me. Oh, time's been going so fast, like since the last refill before that one, I've just been sat on my phone playing games and stuff. Like, that's why we've just refilled it, I've not been recording anything, I've just been sat here chilling, trying to take my mind off of things. But seriously, this is so freaky. The first like half an hour weren't too bad, but it starts getting to your head. Like, I mean, I can't see outside. When I did the Zorbo video, you know, at least I could see outside. It made it feel a lot less claustrophobic, but in here, literally, this is all you can see. It's just red all the way around. It's just so freaky. It's just place mind games with you, and I just want to get out so bad. I just want to get out so bad. I just, I want to go to sleep, I'm so tired. But that's just so risky going to sleep, because what if I go to sleep? I ain't got enough oxygen, I just like pass out and then suffocate. And, you know, I just, I don't want to. I don't know if I'm actually tired or if it's because the air's so thick and it's just slowing me down, you know, I just, I don't know. I just want to get my back aching so much. Oh. Oh. Oh, I wonder if I can curl up into a ball. Oh, oh, that feels so much better. Can't really put my legs down, they're just hovering. Oh no, I just can't get, I can't, I can't get comfortable. There's nothing to look at, nowhere to go. I'm here on my own. If anything goes wrong, nobody's here. What if I start suffocating and it takes Moon like 40 seconds to get here? I could be gone by then. Moon! Moon! Moon, come on! I need ya! Thomas, what's the matter? Moon! What's the matter? I can't, I've got to get out. It's not long to go anymore. I've got to get out, Moon, I just can't do this anymore. I'm freaking out. Shall we just open it up and you crawl out again? No, I need to get out now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna break my way out, I'm gonna pop it. Oh my God, don't! Jesus! Oh my god. Don't! Ah! 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 